in this video we are focused on finding the speed of the red car based on the given information so here we can draw a uh, we can say pictorial representation of what is happening in this very problem and it will look like this now here we can denote that this very point is our red car right now here we can say that this very point is for our police car so it will be like this now here we can say that this distance is y and this distance is z and this very distance from here to here is 40 feet so here we can write that z square will be equals to y square and then it will be here plus 40 raised to the power 2. Now z square value will be equals to y square plus 1600. So we can say that d divided by dt and then it will be z square. Basically we are differentiating both the sides of the equation. So it will be like this over here as well. That is we will be having y square here. And then here we will be having d divided by dt and then it will be 1, 6, double 0. So differentiation of uh, basically we can say uh, constant is 0. So this term is 0 and hence here we will be having the value of 2z and then it will be here dz divided by dt and that is equals to y times dy divided by dt. Now here we can say that we have the information that y is equals to 200 and the z square value will be equals to basically 200 square plus 40 square. So this comes out to be equals to 41600. Now we also know that the value of dz divided by dt is equals to 80 feet per second and z value from here will be equals to under root of 41600. Now if we plug in all those values in the above equation, our equation will look like under root of 41600 and this will be here basically we can say multiplied with 80 outside the under root and then it will be here 200 times dy divided by dt. So this very value is going to be here equals to dy divided by dt and that is equals to basically if we rearrange the equation we will be having under root of it will be here 41600 multiplied with 80 divided by 100 that will be 2 by 5. So from here we can say that dy by dt is going to come around it will be basically 81 and then it will be we can say 0.584 so we have to round it off right so we can write the value of dy by dt to be here equals to 82 feet per second so it can be written like this hence this is our answer for this very problem it is a approximate value so this will be the actual speed of the red car and that's all for this very video.